Hey, what's up everyone? My name is Cap and welcome back to the channel. We're on day 24 of our Darkness Falls series and just kind of like yesterday, I started off this morning by running over and beating on some rocks. Eventually, I'm going to have this entire place cleared out and it'd be interesting to see if there's anything actually here. I, I've had some people asking if there's anything buried underneath this and well, there could be. I have no idea. Anyway, so chip away a little bit here and there. I, I came out just a little bit earlier, grabbed some, or late last night. I don't. I think this car is floating a little higher. Since there were some complaints, I moved the jack lanterns on top of the poles just because, yeah, it does seem a lot more appropriate up there. Uh, let's see, you and you, I can make some more. Another 170, that'll put us up. Nice. That's, that's good. That'll give us a chance to do some serious upgrades to some of the blocks that are out there. That's lovely. Okay, so last night, let's see, what did I did? I made myself a new shotgun. It's only a level 21, but that's the best I can make, but it's better than the level 1 or whatever I was rocking to begin with. Oh, uh, let me see. Okay, so the farming is working. Check it out. We got carrots. Gro oh, they've actually grown. Nice. Potatoes are growing. Tomatoes are growing. So those are still good, but this diamond pattern is actually working. So I'm going to go ahead and keep using this particular pattern, and I think it looks kind of cool. Having it buried in the ground looks pretty sweet. I'm not going to pick these up just yet because I have to have my hoe <laughs> to get those any better. Uh, let's see. That's the other thing I did was basically make some different... Or I switched over to my iron gloves and I think that's about it. Oh, that's the other thing I did. I knew there was something else I worked on. I made myself another blank class book so we can start another quest line here. Used pretty much all the supplies I had and back down to level or 40 of these bundle notes. So yay me. I think I decided the class I'm going to go under with this one is the security class. Mainly the reason why is because A, I can increase my melee usage, attack speed by faster, pain tolerance goes up by a lot, which would be fantastic. And I can rock some higher level um, stamina. Um, stamina. <laughs> I'm sorry, I see the word stamina up here. Rock some higher level armor without being uh, so worn down by stamina usage and blah, 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 all that sort of stuff. So I think this would be the best class. Of course, all of them would be useful. The mechanic class was only going to be good for me, really, once I get to where I'm either needing to make some robotic stuff, which I don't really need right this second, or another vehicle, of course. And let me see, the uh, laborer class is pretty much useless at this point to me, to begin with. I'm just saying there's reasons why it's useful, of course. But half of the stuff that's over here that I can use, I don't need anytime soon. Hammer and forge, like, I literally have most of this stuff. Now, get to here, I can craft a crucible, which would be great. But everything else that's under here would just not be as useful. So I'm thinking, at least for now, the security class would be the best place to start for the next one. It's not like it's the last one I'm ever going to get to use. So, recipes, security, craft. Boom, skis. Okay, and read. Ta-da! You're either in the police force or in the army before the world went to hell. Oh, yeah. Gather wood. Gather wooden club. Okay, so I don't even have to necessarily... Do I have a wooden club in here that I could just pick one up? No? Okay. You know what? If I can just plow through these real fast like that'd be okay. Look at this. They gave me some BDU tops. Huh. BDUs are awesome. Worn boots are kind of garbage. Baseball caps kind of stupid. I'm going to go scrap you. What am I currently rocking here? I have a BDU top. It's 5'5". Five five. This one's 5'5". Five five. Okay. I'll just scrap you. And pants... Five fives and five fives. Okay, so nothing super duper useful. Kill any zombies. I can do that. I can kill zombies. Hello? Oh, oh, that's the other thing. Um, I, I am going to greatly apologize because I cannot remember who actually told me this little secret. Or not a secret, but a pro tip. Having chrysanthemum, which is literally growing all over the place like this. Hey, I'm going to borrow your flower for a second. Hope you don't mind. Um, you can put that in here. Like, check it out. See, I'm, I've been putting chrysanthemum in here now since they told me about that. What in the sweet hell was that? Did I catch another? And look at that. See, it's it's working. Putting putting flowers in there, and it works for the farming or the chicken coops up there and the beehive, which I need to go check those real quick. Oh yeah. So thank you to whomever told me you can put chrysanthemum or golden goldenrod flowers in there. And you actually get all kinds of good stuff. See, look at this. I've just filled it up with chrysanthemum yesterday. Look how much honey I have up here. And I believe both of these are searchable. Yep, look at that. Feathers and eggs. They just went through. Oh, look at all that. Look at all that. Oh, my God. And freaking 
holy crap, man. I just, yeah, I just completely chalked these full of chrysanthemum when I ran up here yesterday. Like 13 eggs. Look at all this honey. And it's still working. A full stack of honey. Oh, thank you very much for who gave me that little pro tip. I don't have to worry about making animal feed as much now. That's fantastic. 13 eggs. That puts us up to 36. A whole bunch of honey. I'm just excited. I'm sorry, I'm just I'm just kind of geeking out here. I'll put you up and put you up here. That's super duper awesome. Make sure to close my door this time. That's so cool. And chrysanthemum is so easy to find. It's everywhere. I don't even have to try and grow some myself. Ooh, there's a zombie. Let's see if we can get a better shot this time we did last time we tried this. Yeah! One shot at him, baby. Last time... Uh, let me see, yesterday, I think it was, there was a group of idiots right around this general area partying. Dude, we split your dome in half. I, I fully, de oh nice, I fully think that that was deserved too. Oh, there's a stump over here. There's an entire complex like right here that we should go through and, oh, I already did that one. You should go through sometime in the near future and see what's up with it. Um... Hang on, there's Eddie right there. There's Edgar over there. There's Walt right... Nope, don't do it. You son of a biscuit. Don't do it. Oh, I didn't get credit for that one. It's okay, it's okay. I hear another pukey. Hey, what's up? You big ugly idiot. Stop blowing up. I need credit for killing you. I'm not going to get any sneak damage with you walking right up on top of me here. Go ahead and get rid of you. Come over here where this little window is. I hear a... Do I hear a doggy? No. Okay, so this area is... Whoops. This area is a little chonky. Headshot. Go ahead and grab... That sounds like Carl. No, it's not Carl. It's just Walter's got the same sound effects. Nope. Dude, I think you moved and I shot Eddie in the face instead. I don't even feel bad. Yep, I hear some dogs over there. Hey, nice. Ooh, some scrap gloves. Okay, so we just swapped out. There's a bunch of dogs inside there. Huh, maybe that's why we haven't done that place yet. We're going to run over here where there's less sound of dogs clawing about and see if we can't continue. This would be great if we could rock through this class real fast today, this security class and be Dunskis. I'd be okay with that. All right, so did I get anything for complete? I got some first aid stuff and gold... Oh, Eh, it gave me a couple things, right? Cure. Okay, so it gave me clean water, chicken rations, first aid bandages. And let me see, what do you give me? A pipe pistol. Nice, 109 millimeter ammo. Yeah. Okay, what do I do? Gather some iron. I've got iron. Boom. Gather leather. I've, I've got leather too. Boom. And gather knuckle wraps. I didn't... Wait, hold on. I didn't put any knuckle wraps in here already, did I? Mm, no, you're not going to count these, are you? No, I didn't figure as much. I thought I'd try it and see. I can make some knuckle wraps. Knuckle wraps. I hate to have to waste leather and stuff for this because I'm not going to get them back. Scrap you, put you back. Kill any zombie again. So you're just giving me garbage weapons to kill zombies with. I'm gonna scrap you. Thank you for the ammo, though. I do appreciate that. That's nice of you. All right, time to kill some more zombies. If this is as complicated as this class gets here, I'm okay with it. Oh, I was like, what exactly did I just see a life bar for? It was my mini bike. Uh, let's see, what do I get for killing things on this one? Just experience. Okay. Well, technically, we could run back across the street over here because there's still some idiots be bopping along in here. I could hear them. And there's some loots and stuff along the outside. Now, I don't know for certain if dogs will count. I kind of think they will. There's a lot of running going on in there. Okay, you're not actually running. You're just kind of shuffling along fast. What you got in here? A repair kit? Not bad. I do hear a snake. Let's see if I can stab you. No. Bad snake. Ha ha. Bad zombie. Sneak up on me. Where did you come from? Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Good shot. Oh, oh, oh. Before I forget, because I've had a couple people ask... Um, recently, and yes, I know sometimes people say that don't actually mean it, but I had some people ask if I'm still accepting postcards from people. Yes, absolutely. From now until forever, 
I am absolutely cool with getting postcards from you guys. I have a big chunk of them. They've slowed down recently because I guess less and less people know about them. When I first started telling people about that, it's been a little while. So I'm guessing some people just, you know, the newer people that are around or whatever, it's been a little while. Totally fine. So, yeah, if you want to send me a postcard from wherever you are, that's totally cool. With oh, hey. Nope. That's totally cool with me. I love getting postcards from you guys. I always show them off during the streams. And so if you guys want to bring some over here, uh, send them to me. Love getting postcards from around the world. And of course, from states that I don't currently live in is always nice too. Don't be a bad dog. Don't be a bad dog. Holy monkey. Craft a spear. I can do that. Okay, so we got a bunch of people showing up over here. See if we can dome some of them here, save a little bit of ammo. Especially the slow idiot hobblers. Keep an eye on things, make sure I'm not going to get flanked. Yeah, okay, so I think I had a person or two ask me why I haven't cleared this spot out over here yet. No reason. Uh, not Nothing specific has made me want to or not want to. Uh, I, I don't really know. There's not really a reason why I haven't come over here. And I guess just because I hadn't thought of it. Or I've been doing other things. I don't know. But I guess technically I can probably do this pretty quickly. Dunn's case. And we got a security class reward. Did we finish it? Security class 5 out of 5 completed. Yeah, yeah. We did. We did. We're security man. My goodness. That was the easiest one I've ever done. I don't need this crappy spirit. Let's open you up and see if you got anything good for us. Oh, nice. Muffle connector mods, armor plate mods. Oh, oh, yeah. That is all good stuff. Especially if I'm going to get to where I can start using some much better armor. You know, like the higher level armor, some steel armor, some reinforced armor. Anything besides padded armor and scrap iron armor. Oh, yeah. Fantastic. Thanks, game. Let's just go ahead and see what we can do with that. Um, see, I'm good on you. I've got the armor plating mod on that one. Okay, so what about you? I've got the muffle connector mod on that. And I've got the advanced muffle connector mod on that. And the advanced one on that one. Okay, let's swap. Wait on. You are the custom fittings mod. Let's, uh, wait, are you advanced? Muffle connector, muffle connector. Okay, so I didn't get any. Uh, okay, I'm gonna, I don't have enough mod spots for all the stuff I want to use here. These, uh, make it so that you don't use, or you get more stamina usage. These, of course, improve your armor rating. Okay, let's see. Can I put anything on any of these? And not bad. I was able to put everything except for one armor plating mod on all the stuff that I have here. That's fantastic. Well, at least I have some stuff I can upgrade to later on. Uh, those are probably not that great compared to the ones I'm currently rocking. Man, today has started off really good. The game likes me again. We, got, uh, we only just barely got dinged and stuff, and somebody gave us some corn. That's awfully nice of them. Ooh, uh, did I make any more food? Ooh, I did. You know what? Steak potatoes. Let's use it. Get our food back up. It's about lunchtime. We can get some steak and taters. Nice. Make sure everything's cleared for a second. My uh, floating car here. <laughs> Eventually, I'll beat this thing down because it basically just gives me stone. Okay, so what other... Uh, hold on. Do I have any... I have skill points. Nice. Okay, so I have one in this one already. It melee speed increase. Okay. Pain tolerant. Oh, nice. I'm wondering if because I already had some books in this, I wonder if that's where some of these came from because I definitely didn't put any points in here. Let's do one more in there and pain tolerance and put one more in here. HP loss reduced by 15% and 60% less chance of being stunned. Oh, yeah. I feel like all of these would actually be useful. Some of these, like I get into the survivalist class, eh, I mean, having charismatic nature all the way up is good, of course, for your buying and selling things. Same thing with wasteland treasure. Survivor is good to have for, you know, that sort of stuff. But it's like, eh, I don't want to waste points putting in there. But when it comes to security, all of these would be useful. What do I get with you? Tactical rigging, titanium club, advanced brass catcher recipe, crafting tier by 10 all the Yeah. So that could actually be useful to get into. Oh, that reminds me. Um, I think I put it up here. That's something I needed to do for a little bit now. Let me grab one of these. I Try that again. I think, therefore I am. I think you can repair with just a repair vehicle. Can you? I mean a repair kit. There we go. Okay. So I was kind of curious as whether you could. I might as well. I've got a bunch of these. Just go ahead and top it off. 
Nice, absolutely wonderful. We'll put these back in here and we're good to go. Jerky looks good. Food and water health is all good. All right, stats are good and it's only noon o'clock. Fantastic. It's day 24, so we still got plenty of time before the next horde night and I don't feel like doing that. I, I, I don't feel like dealing with uh, working on the base today, so we're not going to. I am going to do like I had mentioned a video or two ago. Also, there were some people that corrected me and appreciate that. I'm going to go over to the Triangle House because I like that house and it's been a little bit since I've seen it. It wasn't the last Darkness Falls series that I had the Triangle House as my neighbor, neighbor, um, neighbor, was it neighbor Ted? Is that what I called him? Lived there? I can't even remember. It was my Wasteland Warrior series that we went through and raided this house. I never did make this my own home, of course. It was just, it wasn't that great for durability. You know, considering it's like mostly glass. Now, I think some of it's bulletproof glass, if I remember correctly. It's been a minute since I've been over here. But yeah, that was during the Wasteland Warrior series. Where, where are you dropping? Hang on. You're dropping some treasures off for us? Of course you put it up in the mountains, because you suck. You suck. That's where you put the last one. I, the, at least there's a small little rope. Don't scream at me. At least there's a small little rope. What is this? Hang on, is, what is... What in the... Like... What... What is this? Is it just supposed to be like a hedge? That's kind of interesting. Didn't even see this bag that I ran past. Sure, I'll go ahead and scrap you. Uh, now I'm going to find the triangle house. I lost it. I thought it was right up here. There it is. Just one turn away. Cop car will deal with you right now. Actually, I have a lock pick. Let's see if I can do this. First try here. We did not get a first try. We did actually break a lock pick. Tom's like, way well, done, man. That's stuff and things. Ammo, ding dong knocker that I'll just scrap. You, I don't even think I have anything else I can put you on. I've got a few of those serrated blade mods. What's up, Lois? Lisa, what's you doing? Just kind of roaming around over here? You can do your thing, huh? I'll leave you alone. I'm going to park you right out here. See how many people come visit us while we're here. Oh, nice. I can scrap you and scrap you and get some more notes. Fantastic. Thank you, game. I'll go ahead and just drink you just to get you out of my inventory. Are y'all actually coming over here or... Just the way the zombies are, they're a little bit further away. Wait a minute. Hang on. They look so tiny compared to this car. Look at that. Why are y'all so small? They're actually punching this car, which would be hilarious if it just exploded and killed them. But look how small they are compared to this car. I don't know exactly what's going on there as far as perspective and what it's doing there, but that's kind of funny. I don't, I don't know what's going on. Bong! Oh, that's a decent wrench and the repair kit. Let's see, block damage of 40. Um, our ratchet's still better, but that's a good little wrench. Now, I don't remember. I think you gotta go in through the back door. Is this. Hello? Oh, there's a football player. Lovely. Definitely don't want to be in close quarters with him. Who's screaming at me? Oh, it's Kyle. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Hang on, hang on. You're going to wake up everybody. Dang it, why can't I run and jump here? I'm trying to land on top of the fence if you can't figure out what I'm doing. Well, that worked. Come here, you big idiot. Shh. You're making too much noise. Uh, actually, I think there's a way to get in around through the back fence. This isn't a quest mission by any stretch of the imagination. I'll just talk to you, sir. Stay down. This isn't a quest mission, so I can leave it whenever I want to. This is just because I want to for funsies. Oh, also, um, I was mentioning here... Uh, it's been a little bit since I've mentioned it, whatever, but, uh, you know, of course, as always, a tremendously humongous thank you for everybody who's been buying the merch... Uh, let's see, We the new merch shop went live in July, and July, what, was the best month for merch we've ever had, and then in August, you guys beat July's record for most amount of merch at one time, and then in September, y'all beat, oh hell, 
y'all beat uh, August. Sorry, I'm having a brain while uh, shooting feral people running at me here. Brittany! Back up, lady. Anyway, what I'm saying is every month since the the uh, new merch services went live, you guys have beaten the record every month for the number of merch purchases, and I can't thank you enough for that. I'm truly, truly grateful for that. Uh-huh. Sounds like I woke up, everybody. Um, I Sorry, I can't get in there to help you out. If you want to stick your face through... The, oh, that works. Yeah, that works great. Yeah, go ahead and make just a little peephole. Uh oh It's too big of a peephole. Don't do it. Uh oh Hang on, Tom. Things are going dumb real quick. Got to get rid of the football player because he makes everybody run. He's a feral stripper. Hey, we leveled up. Bonk. Keeping on our surroundings because I hear other people. Holy monkey. I need to repair my AK, but the problem is I don't have another AK to repair it. And if I... I don't even think I can make one. I could technically make one, but it's only a level 11. So this one's going to break pretty soon. I'm going to have to rely on other weapons. This loops all the way back around to these idiots over here. Check out this pool. Got that sweet diving board. Although the diving board is made out of concrete. I don't think that's going to do very much. Um, tell you what. How about you stick your head through the door. And I'll stab you in the freaking forehead. Do it again. Come here. Oh, we missed. Try again. Stick your head through. Oh, there we go. That works. Peekaboo! That ain't working. Let's try this. That worked. If I can blow you guys' mind before I even get inside, that'd be great. This place has a ton of zombies. You know what would be just be wonderful? Is, I mean, you can take all these apart and you can get all the pieces and stuff for it, but it'd just be so nice if you could pick up solar things and take them with you, solar banks. Now, I don't have any panels to put in them, so it would be, you know, less than useful to have them. But, I mean, look how many things you can get here. It's just like a bunch of free iron and stuff and things. All right, let's peek around to make sure there's nobody else. There's one more idiot right there. Come here, you. That's what I was trying to do with Kyle over there, and it just didn't work. There's another one. couple people. This kind of has like the whole um, Night of the Living Dead, the old school black and white George, George Romero classic, you know, of zombies just slowly walking towards the house. It's kind of sweet. I thought last time there was some ammo up here or something. But check out this pool. With the new water, that actually looks really cool. You could probably make something like this yourself. Probably. Alright. See how many people are awake in here that we... Or ha yep, how many people are stomping around in here that we woke up that didn't quite make it. Okay, not much in this room. Just a few supply boxes. Let me check outside. Since these doors are open, these idiots can definitely get to me. Yep. Come here. Here, let me help you out. Okay, you're going really slow with this. It's just wood. There you go. Hey, what's... Ow, you son of a... Dude, I'm trying to help you. What's up, beggar? You got bonked. You got bonked right in the face hole. I hear some more shuffling. Okay, how about you just shuffle on right that direction? Okay, let me see. This room is clear. The garage has got... I think that's where the football player was. Yeah, it looks like he managed to make his way out, so the garage is clear to get into. Those boxes had just garbage. Mostly just supplies. I mean, you see stuff I got over here. Really nothing useful. Nothing. Nothing useful. Supplies. And yes, I am stomping over all of the dead bodies that I could be getting nitrate from. I'm not... Ooh. Is that a radiated white? Oh, that's not good. No, it's just a radiated thug. Okay, it's not a white. It's just a thug. We can deal with him. I know that block isn't going to stop. That more or less just... They can still get to me, but it kind of half slows them down for a second. Son of a monkey. We have a whole freaking horde over here. Okay. Let's do this. Regular thug. Lay your happy butt down. 
this might actually be a horde. Like a, a wandering horde. No. Don't do it, man. It's gonna blow up my block. Hang on, gotta reload. Uh-oh. Back up, sir. No. 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 Uh-oh. Yep, this is a full-size uh, wandering horde that's coming in here. I need to get out of this house. Excuse me, bodies. Yep, this is a full-size wandering horde. Let's see what we got going on here. Yep, there's a cup. There's a plethora. I'm going to get y'all to follow me over here real quick. You... Oh, hell! Knocked us into the water. Can't shoot at AK under the water. All right, let's just see if we can't move on out of this general area. Kind of put them on the other side of us. You idiots that keep blowing up are making this way more challenging than it needs to be. Okay, some of you idiots are definitely making things way harder than it needs to be here. Hey, Brittany! No hits. Uh-oh, that's a doggy. It might be inside, though. No, oh, that's the dog that's outside. Holy crap. Okay. Damn it. I can't hit them. Hang on. We got to use a bandage. We got to do it on the run here. Get the get the uh, health to go back up a little bit. Holy cow. Okay. Oh, man, they they showed up with some... Ch What's up, Tom? Just building inspector sort of thing going on here? All right, so you made... Hey, none of that. None of that. Got hung up on the chair. Got hung up on the chair. We'll go back and collect loot bags in just a second. Hey, what's up, dude? Yep, I hear you, dog. We're just going to keep on running for a second. Bad dog. Bad, bad dog. Lisa? Don't be bringing any of your friends over here. Walt, you need to lay down and stay down. Hang on, don't blow up. Don't blow up. Well, I mean, I guess you... No, I don't want you to blow up. Hey, get off of me. We ain't friends. Dude. I'm bleeding again. You people suck. Hang on, let's lead you out here into the street. There's a dog right there. That might be... No, that's a wolf. Hey, ma'am. Good lord. This place is... This place is rough. This place is rough, man. All you idiots running at me are not helping. Alright, slowly, slowly. What you doing with your hand? We're slowly making our way through. We haven't even got inside the house really yet. Whew. Okay, save a little bit of ammo. You're just a... Uh, just a walker, dude. Let's check, see what loot you brought us. Another wrench. Okie dokie. You're feral. No, you're festering. You're not a feral. Did you bring me any loot? A shovel. Nice, since I don't know what I did with my shovel. What's up, Tom? Oops. Stay down. Stay down. Okay, are we good for a second? I hear somebody over there. Okay, uh, we'll tell you what, we're gonna go ahead and, actually, does jerky give me any health? Nope. But I do need to eat some, because the food's getting a little bit low, so I might as well pause real quick and have a drink, or have a bite, use another first aid, get some of that health to go back up a little bit. Dang! Having a wandering horde show up while I'm in the process of clearing out a, you know, a fairly challenging POI to begin with, it's kinda sucked. You're locked. All right, so if all the rest of you idiots are still indoors, I can handle that. Or at least I think I can. I didn't bring any vitamins, which I probably should have. All right, come here. Come here, Lisa. Keep you down. At least some of them brought some trick-or-treating bags. That's nice of them. So we can get some loots before we even get in the house. Ooh, green key card. Nice. And research notes. I think we have a blue and a green key card now. So once we finally find those bunkers, we should be good to go. A hoodie, meh. Those are good. I'll take those. Sweet. I still hear a whole bunch of bouncing around. Did Tom finish inspecting the roof? Man, this place went crazy fast. Hazmat pants and a hazmat jacket. Oh, yeah. More hazmat pants. 
Hang on, let me make sure everything's reloaded after all of that. This AK's only got about another shot or two in it, and then it's going to be done. Excuse me. Did I have any repair kits on me? I do. I hate to do it. I hate to do it. Because it's going to lose some... It didn't lose a lot. That's okay. It didn't lose a lot, so that's okay. Uh, let me see. I never did finish searching here because things went bad. Is that just a scrap? Yeah, it's just a scrap. Take the brass, though, because I need it for bullet casings. Another shovel. We good for a second? If y'all can leave me alone for a second, that'd be great. Let's see if I can get a tire from this. We did! Nice! Scavenging skills have increased. Who's that? Another feral thug. Sub, dude! Yeah, you can just beat on that all you want to. I'll wait for... Do I hear another dog, too? Hang on. Dog or a wolf? Hang on, hang on. We might as well go deal with these idiots real quick because they're going to be here in just a second anyway. Check your corners. Look at all these dead. No. This is a bad neighborhood. This is a real bad neighborhood. Hang on. Let me check around this floor. What's up, dude? Nope. Nope. Dude's freaking awesome at strafing here and making me miss. Nut shot. Okay, and this I can just straight up bonk you right in the face. Uh, cat food and chili. Trying to give me indigestion, I see. I think there's a safe right there. We'll come back and get that in a second. Just trying to make sure everything... That's a lot of pictures. One of these days, I want to have my picture on a painting in the wall. Now, all of these were like Kickstarter people, I'm pretty sure, of some sort or variety. I was a Kickstarter for this game too, but I didn't I didn't do the tier high enough to be able to uh, get my face in the game. I don't remember. I got I did the tier that allowed me to have early access to the game. So that's the one I did. But it would be so cool to have, you know, some I hate to say us popular YouTubers, that's that's some douchey saying that, but some of us have been making content in this game for freaking ever. It would be cool if we could get our faces permanently affixed to a painting in this game, you know? I think that'd be pretty sweet. Okay, let's see if we can get in here on the first try. First try! Nice! Ding dong knocker, muzzle brake mod, buckshot. You know, the muzzle brake mod works good for shotguns, I believe. Reduces recoil. Can I slap you on here? Really? I can't put you on there? I feel like I should be able to put you on there. I can put you on there, though. That'll help out with the... Uh... That's the wolf. You know... Oh, hey. They made a door here. Wow. Did y'all see that? Dude just got shot in the back of the head and shrugged it off. Props to you, sir. Oh. All right in the taint. You're over there trying to eat my meats. Well, at least you brought me a trick-or-treating bag. Oh, nice. I can use that to repair the one I have. Some... Okay, that's stuff and things. Not bad. Okay, well. Let's see if we can finish looting at least the bottom floor of this house. We're going to run out of... Wait a minute. Hang on. This looks familiar. Obviously, it looks familiar. I went through this house. And it looks familiar as I feel like there was like a, some sort of trap here. Wait, are these just paintings? Why can't I search you? Blunt weapons? I might as well. Can scrap you and take you up. Okay. Wait, seriously? Are those just... Those are just paintings. Oh, whoever had this made this POI nerfed it. Those used to be four bookshelves right there. Rude. Oh, um, actually, you know what? I have a better lock pick that's probably a little faster. Much faster, actually. Oh. The door's open. I guess I didn't need to do that. But whatever. Dishwasher? All right. Well, we found a couple things. Let's see. I found a book. I can scrap you. Let's see. Real quick, just to get you out of the way, I can slap you on there. That'll clear up a little bit of room. Not a lot. Let me sort you out. Let me see. Didn't I? I have two of these tempered blade mods. Can, let me, can I put one or both of those on here? I sure can. Yeah, yeah. 
And that's pretty much, you know what? Hang on, let me, let me actually, I'm gonna put you in there because I don't need one piece of paper right this second. Great, crickets are chirping, it's 1900 o'clock and we have not even got through the first floor of this house yet. This, and we are definitely, we are definitely not going into the basement yet, which is right down there because that's a big place that kind of sucks. We will, uh, let me see. We might be brave and dumb enough to go upstairs just yet. There's zombies up here. Despite all the noise we've been making, there's always... Yep, see, here they are. Oh, hey, crap, I forgot we tried to modify our shotgun. Okay, okay, we can we can just go straight bonkaroo and you idiots that are just walking. I'm okay with that. Books right there, maybe. Oh, God, it honestly kind of startled me. If I recall, there's a few people sleeping in this room. Wake up. Who dat? Who dare? I hear him traipsing around. Oh, hey, it's a radiated Big Mama job. Ow, you suck, Big Mama. Back up, lady. Dang, woman. What did you have for breakfast today? Your breath is nasty. Okay, good. These are both bookshelves. Um... No, I'm just going to scrap it. I don't need to make a spear. Scrap you, scrap you, and take you. At least I get a little bit more paper. Upstairs, I know there's some idiots over there. See, both of these rooms are locked. Is there anybody in there? Doesn't look like it. This is a nasty bathroom. I'll run over here and check real quick. Uh-oh. Maybe I was wrong. Oh, God, that is not the one you want to be wrong about. Big dude hits hard. What are you? Oh, you're another big dude, too. No. Uh oh, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. No. Don't blow up. You blew up. And you hit really hard. Oh, dude. Holy crap. Okay, we need to use some health. <laughs> this house is rough. Holy cow. I need a bigger first aid kit than the one I have. Soldier Boy hits pretty hard. I'm going to just go ahead and use another one of these. Get some of that up there real quick. Wow, look at this. We got stuff and things. Look at all this. Just parts of stuff. And I'm not even sure if I need any of this, but some of it looks good. Oh, crap. Okay. Um, okay. So I, I hate doing this sorts of thing because I realize it, but I'm making an executive decision. Everything is already terrible. Everything is already terrible. We have no time left before everything starts running. There's everything that's already feral is going to turn extra feral. We've already dealt with a lot today, and I need to get some health up and unload some inventory. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to go back to the house, sleep for tonight. Sorry, I thought I saw something on the road that I needed. Sleep for tonight, unload our inventory, and then come back over here tomorrow and finish looting this place. Because downstairs, we got to get through that big vault door, which should be way easier. The first time I came through here back in the Wasteland Warrior... I'm almost 100% certain that I beat down that vault door downstairs with a stone axe. And it took me so long to do that. So, so incredibly long. But, <laughs> we need to kind of recover. T today was a little bit rough over there. They hit hard. And I went too far north to get back to the base. I gotta circle back around a little bit here. Whoa, don't hit anything. Anyway, so that's going to be pretty much it. We're just right around the corner from the house here. So I'm going to go ahead and wrap this one up as we're driving back home. But anyway... Today was a good day. We got a lot of good loot. We got through the security class, got it unlocked and rocking it. But anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, do me a favor, leave a like on it. If you're new here, make sure you subscribe. If you're not already, so you don't miss out on future videos, of course. And in the meantime, you guys have a wonderful day, and I will talk to you later.